Hello everybody, my name is Axel and welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV and Walker. So we're currently on the MSQ Gateway of the Gods, so we're gonna talk to Lys. And I think Tower of Babel is a... It's another dungeon, so I'm excited for that. Let's go. Uh, I think I've equipped... Yeah, I bought new tanking gear because I don't trust that my... Augmented Crypt Lurker will survive in a, in a level 81. I th so I guess. What? What? Bleh. <laughs> 83. So I guess it's a level 83 dungeon. Okay. Let's go. What up, Lise? Oh, I think we have an animation here. Cool. Oh, they made sure of it. I wish you'd made sure to bring a code. <laughs> Especially who, Lise? I think she can she can manage. Oh yeah, oh 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 yeah, she doesn't wear okay. Oh <laughs> Barely enough cloths to swaddle a newborn. Clearly you have spent too long around this feral dog of a dog. <laughs> <laughs> Expect me not to warm your ill-prepared hide. These first are for myself and my Nama alone. <laughs> Little son. <laughs> And they're ready to slug it out. <laughs> oh, so you... Sh oh, she's gonna... I think we're gonna start the dungeon already. Yeah, the trusts. Yeah, I think we're gonna... Okay. I thought there'll be another step here, but I guess we'll head directly to the... To the dungeon. Tower of Babel. Free of unnecessary encumbrances, if rather more susceptible to the cold. Alright. Oh yeah, they shed their... Uh, winter clothing. They're back to their regular clothes. Alright. Pippin's group has gone ahead to the Encladium. Alright. Alright. What? So we'll need to make our own way to the Encaladium. Oh! Yeah, I think uh, Tancred's part of the scouting group. So... Where the hell's Pippin? Oh, he's still over there. Okay, let's... Speak... With Pippin. Where is he? All the way over there. Cool. Okay, we have people here, so... Oh, they're the Black Mage Lalafels. So Pippin's here. Oh, uh, there. Uh, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There. What up? What up, Pip? Hail! But we're given only the cursory explanation. I'm glad you've recovered. Oh, of course. Alright, so they managed to punch through here. From Lente's tears will lead the way into the station. I'll join you soon. So... what? What? Wait at the destination inside the station. So we have to go in. Alright, proceed to station. Waiting. Waiting. All right. Animation? Cutscene? Voiced, please? No? Hopefully it's voiced. What up? What? 
this is several okay so no voice oh the hell oh I guess the diversion's working now ah <laughs> time to go We should be presented with the opportunity to vanquish Anima, we must seize it. I think it's a bit early to destroy the big bad here, if Anima is the big bad. Alright, I, I guess Anima is just a stepping stone? We'll see. Okay, we came to help the people of Galmal, and that's what we're going to do. The train should be along any moment now. Prepare to board. Alright. The step people are itching for a fight. I think these are Dalmascan uh, resistance. And these are the Scions. Oh hell yeah, we're- oh! The Tower of Babel now accessible, yep, so it's the next dungeon for Endwalker. Uh, yeah. Hmm. Yep. So let's set up the trust here and we'll proceed to the Tower of Babel. Farewell, Varus. Varus, yeah. May the gods have mercy on your soul. Come. The other two await. The other two? Oh, Zeno and Fandaniel? Alright. Hello. This madness ends here. Oh, hush. This is the best part. <laughs> Enough! And there's a barrier. being gathered is not feeding anyone. Some manner of magical defense. Oh, Kyle, what up? Kyle? But how? Oh, Rydalyn! Yes. The shackles that bind my adversary will not be so easily broken. Rydalyn! Feeble relic of a forgotten age. Hark, victory is mine. Ooh. Kinda like what happened with Bahamut. Bahamut. Ooh. All crystal stock. Oh, not enough power. All right. One more seal remaining. No more ether. And I was so close. My lord, 
A slight change of plans. We shall travel to the moon and break this wretched barrier ourselves. Whatever it takes. What was that? Is this a rocket? The final order issued by Anima to the Tempered Thrones. What? Should the Empire fall, the world must share her fate. Ooh. So they're gonna run amok now. Of course. Father lacked the conviction to give such a command. The abomination born of his flesh was but a puppet, and I the puppeteer. You madman, you monster! There's a funny joy in watching your flailing attempts to fight the inevitable. <laughs> You're all going to die, and are powerless to prevent it. Oh, a teleporter. Alright. We really must be on our way. You're welcome to give chase, provided you are content to leave comrade and tempered alike to die screaming. No! Oh, so that's not how we go to the moon. I think we're gonna use another method. Too much of this child. Tend to her. The last bran at Mare Lamentorum is yet unbroken. Zodiac remains bound. Mare Lamentorium. Sea of Lament, I guess. Shifted the flow of ether and sent the enemy far from their destination. Oh, <laughs> all right, that's cool. Now, I shall divert it once more. An ally awaits, and I will deliver you unto him. An ally? Seek his aid. Restore the seal. Zodiac must not be set free. Who's Hydaelyn's ally? Maybe Reem. The Tempered are running wild. Not only those at the tower, but those back at the camp. Whoa. The others are doing their best to contain them, but the situation is growing beyond our control. Leave them to die or give up the chase. Just like Van Daniel said. You go back, I go to the moon. Yep. You're... You're going alone? Yes. Why not? I didn't said there's an ally there. You have our trust and our faith. I pray we have yours. I don't have a choice. <laughs> yep, you gotta help them Garleans, yo. Our friends and the Tempered need our help. We will save as many as we can, I swear. Once we have matters well in hand, we'll join you on the moon. Until then, be careful. There's no telling what you'll find. I don't think they know the concept of oxygen and breathing. Huh. <laughs> so what up? If all the tempered are affected, Eulus and his comrades likely put up quite the struggle. Alright. I leveled up, yeah. 
You may now enter the Tower of Babel with a party of NPC avatar. Okay, blah, 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 blah. Yes. How much experience did I get from that? Ooh, almost 2 million experience. Alright. That's cool. Hmm. Hide. What up, Graha? A trip to the moon. He still, ha still has an attachment to the trappings of his past. Whether knowing this will make... Oh, oh yeah, alright. Yeah, this ally of hers can provide you with the necessary assistance to restore the seal before Xenos and Van Daniel arrive to stop you. Who the hell is that ally? Activate the teleportation device. And we are off to the moon. To marry Lamentor. Long, long before Dalamud was forged to imprison an elder primal. Oh, okay. The eldest of them all, savior of the star, was sealed within a moon of his own. Zodiac? Souls sacrificed to grant him life still slumber and dream of the day he and we will be made whole. Oh yeah, Zodiac. Here he waits, in this cold, barren place, his cradle and his grave. Silent lamentations and prayers of hope echo soundlessly to a sundered star, adrift and alone. Mmm, the Sea of Stars, Mary Lamentorium. Oh, so I guess that's... Oh. oh, maybe he's a... Uh, the opposer Atiens. Hello. Speak with the ancient spirit. Is he moving away now? All right. Let's attune this first. Ah. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> I think it's going to take a while to attune all the aetherites here, if at all possible. Yeah, attuning. Cool. How much does it cost? Whoa! <laughs> oh, man. Oh, about 500 to warp to Garlemald. <laughs> Alright. So where the hell is that? Oh, hello. What about people? So we have here... An Asian. Hello. Return. I must return. Lingering grief. Grief. Alright. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Oh, since we're not sync, I have this uh, expiation or whatever how you pronounce it. Hello. I want, I need. What? What? You mustn't touch. 
In Cerulean Halls, find me. Man, it's so beautiful here. Yeah, the land is barren, but holy hell, look at that. Man. Gotta take some uh, screenshots here. Yep. <laughs> Coolness. So where do we go? Oh, we can summon our mount. Yeah, they say that I should mute my mount music to appreciate the music in all the places here in Endwalker, but I really like the Wayward Daughter, so... <laughs> I don't know. So there's a destination here. Oh, what's this? Holy hell. So we are surveying. Who's gonna come here? Who's, who's the ally that Heidelin said? I'm guessing it's Reen. No steps echo through this looming spar save your own, but you nevertheless sense a presence above. Above? How do we go above? Oh, here. Alright. Above we go. Oh, here. The Watcher. What are you watching? Is that Zodiac? I guess that's Zodiac. And he's being watched by the Watcher. Jesus, that's tall. Hello. Out of practice at conversation. Damn. So Heidelin made the moon. And I guess it was the Allegans who made the who made Dalamud. Huh. I'm responsible. Yeah. So that's Zodiac then. Ooh. Projection of the moon's core. Whoa. Grows more powerful with every rejoining. Seven and the one in the first would have been eight. The eighth uh, rejoining if he hadn't stopped it. All right. For all the servants' machinations, he remains incomplete. The fallen are beyond salvation. But Fen Daniel already attempted to free him. Oh, oh yeah, oh, okay, okay. Yes, we know. That's why we're here. Grants to bind Zodiac forever. Five were destroyed. By his would be liberator. One of these I have restored. Oh, so it can be restored. Oh, being impeded. By those? Soul sacrificed to summon Zodiac, the manifestation consequence of the waning sea. Oh! So they're walking about here. So they're the ones stopping. The restoration? Oh. So we get rid of them. I think it will lead to the same result though. Ask a thousand souls and receive a thousand answers. Oh. So, you're throwing us here uh, like a moral dilemma, alright. Should we destroy the souls used summon to summon Zodiac so that the prison can be 
mended? Oh, I'm the watcher and the jailer. I'm not the judge. All right. No more sacrifices will be made in his name, nor will those souls rendered up his name fade into oblivion. Now, so, gotta talk to them first. So he tried to fix some of the broken locks, but the wandering souls here are impeding him. Okay. A trip to the moon. Coolness. The Watcher. Sea of Sorrow. There, see? Or, uh, yeah, I think I said Sea of Lament. But yeah, Sea of Sorrow. You must confront those lost souls, yes, but you need not expel them by might of arms. A feather touch, a firm, firm word, simple methods may send them away. Faint echoes as they are. We are the strength of sentiment that drives them, however. Emotions that do not fade even with the passage of centuries. And make haste, though yet distant, unwelcome guests draw near. <laughs> Holy hell. I want to imagine Fun Daniel and Xenos walking all over the moon trying to get here. <laughs> Ow! Oh, there's a mender here. Oh, I think it's uh, below. Okay. Speak with the faded spirit. Ow! Where, when, how long? But not all of them were offered... Uh, volunteered for this, right? Some were forcibly... Offered to Zodiac. Huh. Uh, do we have uh, an Aether Current here? 500 Yams to the north. Was it truly so? Yeah, I think it's longer than the time Midgard Sormer arrived here. Okay. Speak with a forlorn spirit. Oh, somber spirit now. Hello. Every soul a drop of blood flowing through its veins. To live, to learn, create, to make better. The star flourished, as did we. So I guess this is the ASEAN history. Do you remember? Uh, no. We are a Zem, right? One of the convocations? As the whispers die, the final spirit fades. No shadows of times long lost remain around the drowning brand. So can they be mended now? Oh, what up, doggy? Hello. What up? <laughs> okay. An unusually lustrous dog is gazing at you with what seems to be fond anticipation. So we gotta follow you? Alright. Lustrous dog. And try not to fall behind. Okay. What are you doing there? Oh, I think fishing? They're fishing here? Alright. Where's the dog? Hey! Wait up. Hello. Temperamental spirit. What up? 
We and the star were fulfilled. Wanted for naught, mourned for naught. Okay. I thought sometimes we have to fight stuff, How sometimes we don't. Alright. The final days taught us to fear a death forced upon us. The injustice of duties and dreams left unfulfilled. The grief of unexpected partings. Swift as darkness, cold as ash. Such tra tragedy, yet no catharsis. Such truth, yet no consolation. And uh, I'm not sure, but I think they're uh, regretting what they did. All is silent near the brand. So we talk to the dog again. Hello, dog. Okay, so we're gonna follow the dog again. Coolness. What the hell is that? What's that? Whoa. Is this Luna Tender Queen? Alright. <laughs> Maybe it's a mark. It seems kind of a unique monster here. And it's level 90. Okay, so we can't fight that. Yeah, I think it's a target. So let's not bother with it for a while. All right. Unable to execute command while mounted. All right. Regards the shadow that lurks behind the brand. Anguished spirit. Okay. Cool. Perfection came crumbling down. Such overwhelming despair. The end was nigh. Let me try to give these spirits some voices. The faintest glimmer of hope remained. We gave our lives that others may live. We give ourselves to Zodiac. And thank you for making it this far in the video. If you liked it, hit that like button. And to be updated with future content, hit subscribe and the notification bell. Links to my social media are in the description down below. And if you fancy some more videos, you can check out this playlist. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the continuation of this video series.